Good morning. Today I'm at the drawing board and we're going to discuss steps to setting up a timber frame design. One of the first things I do when setting up a timber frame design is establish some general frame rules or general frame notes. Number one says joints are laid out two inches off the layout face and then two inches thick. This is one of the standards of square rule joinery. Number two says all joints are framed down to the next half inch in size. This is the reduction you do to an, a timber to make all the joints the same size so they'll all go together. Rule number three says, says bents are laid out from the south except the northmost bent. And to the left of that you can see a compass with a north arrow. This is what we call plan north or the north of the plan or the drawing. It's not necessarily true north to where the building is going to sit. This is just for using the plans. If we look at this current plan on the drawing board, which is for Jim the tradesman, we can see that this footprint of the building is 28 feet wide by 50 feet long and our north arrow our physical 3D north arrow in our drawing is pointing to the north so our compass on our plan has to also point to the north that way our general frame rule number three applies to all the bents. Bents are laid out from the south except the northmost bent. The northmost bent has to be laid out from the outside of the building in order for all the joints to be flush on the outside. Braces are framed to four inches thick and all tenons are trimmed one eighth inch in one eighth inch in length. We will discuss these further at another time. The next step is to add a grid system to the plan. What this means is we're going to call this corner on bent one and wall A. So this post which is here, a 10 by 10 post, is post 1A. When we back out we can see we have post in wall B. We also have a post in wall C which is the center wall. So at any time we can discuss a particular post, we can say I need a dimension on post 2C. So we automatically know that this is post 2C. This helps identify every timber in the entire frame or every post in the entire frame. Jim's barn is laid out so that each bent is 12 foot 6 inches on center so that it comes out to be 50 feet long. The reference face of each bent is the south face so the dimension for the reference face is 12 foot 1 and then a 12 foot 6, 12 foot 6 and 12 foot 11. The reasons why these change is because this is the northmost bent and that's the reference faces on the outside of the building. 
when I draw a timber frame design I put the north arrow in the design itself so I always know which way is pointing north I hope you enjoyed this short video of how to set up a timber frame design